What do you think it would take to make material circularity standard practice? Policy would help. Something that would help drive and kind of require the deconstruction as opposed to landfilling things like we might normally. So I think that policy could play a big role in kind of helping move and create the demand, like push the demand. And I think really just changing how we design and deliver buildings is going to be need to be part of that. I would definitely second policy, deconstruction ordinances. That's something like a, a Portland, Oregon has, uh, Palo Alto, California, even San Antonio, Texas. Um, and while they're all shaded a bit different, San Antonio is looking at historic preservation, Portland, Oregon is looking at uh, streak of materials. Um, there's a lot of incentives, both sticks and carrots, that I think push the market forward. Um, the permitting process, which is so important to, to contractors and developers. How can you, if you can prove uh, circularity, if you can turn the demo into deconstruction drawings and, and prove out where these materials are going, can you get two weeks back on your permit? Policy is the thing, is the tipping point, right? Sure. That's going to create the business case and the business model for the warehousing and storage and, and the companies that are doing the reuse and, and, and refurbishment of these materials.